Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm working on some Christmas ornaments. You can see that. I'm going to dip them on this bubble wrap plastic. And it is a very, very easy technique and I'm going to start right away. I am going to add some iridescent silver by Pebio here on this spot. And some Halo Turquoise by De La Rowney. Some Turquoise Blue by Amsterdam. And I've got Iridescent Green Blue. I'm working on a bubble wrap because it's just like there is some movement in here. It's like a trampoline, very small trampoline pieces. And by pushing it into the, pa into the paint, I, I can get easily uh, the whole surface covered. So the turquoise one, this is the, the side that is already done a few days ago. And you can see also the sides because of the bubble wrap. I could dip into the paint so I'm going to do that side and when they are all finished I make sure with my skewer that the holes are still open and nice so very easy everyone can do this you can also do it without bubble wrap but I think it is easier to use it with the bubble wrap so maybe a little bit more coverage on this I think I didn't push it in hard enough I also want the sides to be covered and now I have to watch I'm making it very dirty on the side that I already had done now I like it very much I can see an air bubble that's no problem another one when I'm done with dipping all my Christmas ornaments I'm going to use my torch but because one side was already done I am going to clean that back before I lay it aside so that it is nice and clean so like that that was my very first one I've got four ornaments of every color so I think I need a little bit more for this slightly bigger angel so I'm going to speed you up because it's a lot of, uh, of the same and then I'll show you the wet and the dried results um, when I'm done. So have fun, it will probably go fast, I will speed you up. So here is the wet result. The tur turquoise is hard to catch on camera, but that first row is turquoise. 
red and white, gold and white, and also bronze, green, white and gold, blue, white and gold, copper, gold and red, white, graphite, silver, uh, pearl white. This is so, so gorgeous, right? And two big stars. I've got a little white owl, a very fluffy white owl that will come in here. So I really wanted some white, but also some color. So this is it. And you want to know my most favorite one? It is this one. Cells that appeared very very beautiful unfortunately I don't have any Christmas decorations in blue so I can't hang it in my own tree this one is so gorgeous right marvelous uh, I don't have to use a skewer anymore because I had the wonderful idea to blow on the hole when I was done dipping so no skewer needed anymore if I even had that idea a few days ago <laughs> that would be great but yeah that is how it goes right so this were the wet results I'll be back for the dry results I am going to paint some bubbles some Christmas bubbles they are made of glass and they are white now, but I'm going to give them some more color. So let's have some fun together. I am going to layer up a cup. <clears throat> I've got some custom um, golds, rosé golds in here and I am going to use them. Just some colors that I had left and hopefully I don't need that much. Very beautiful shimmery colors. That's in my cup. Can you see some beautiful gold and rosé gold colors? My bubble <clears throat> in the right place. And all I am going to do is just pour it over here. And hopefully I will have enough. Just dabbing on the bottom of the bubble to make sure that it's all covered. There's a thing in here that I don't want to. so nice that my bubble is turning and twisting a lot. I'm just <clears throat> going to get it out. Hopefully like this. Yes, I've got it. And a piece over here. So I'm just going to
got a tiny bit in here. I'm just going to make sure that everything is covered. Okay, this is going to drip. I'm going to put it aside. Everything is covered. <coughs> it looks good. So, paint will drip <coughs> off and that is just fine. I am going to use this cup with the leftover paints of all my bubbles and I'm going to use it just having fun let's see what this is going to be I think I'm going to do my other one too with um, with the same color is that no that's not in Emma. And it will drip down. Oh, maybe I even. Oh, now I have to decide. Maybe I even like this one more. So then I want to pour some more pink over here. I'm not sure. Because I really like the effects on the bubble over here. And I'm one bubble down because I broke one. <laughs> Otherwise I would grab another ball bubble right now and do another one. I think I I will let them dry like this. Yes, I will do that. So I can clean up. Scrape my paints, use them for another project and then let these dry and I will be back for the dried results. So here are my messy bowels. My shimmery up close. <laughs> Very curious how this will dry and you'll see I'll be back with the dried results. Here are all my ornaments. They are dry and ready for the Christmas market. I've got two of these cute, oh, cute stars with a white fluffy owl in there. Here are a few of the Christmas baubles. The wooden uh, ornaments that I dipped. I really love this rosé gold bow box, beautiful. And I wish I had done more of these red ones. I really love them. This, the, that one is very pretty. And some bow box over here. So this is what I'm going to bring to my Christmas markets. I also forgot trees. You probably saw that in 
um, a previous video. I will link it up here. And I hope uh, you like this. Please give me a thumbs up. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please do so. It is free. It won't cost you a dime. And I hope I see you next time. Have a great day.